Hey everybody, Jeremy Senpai here. Thank you so very much for clicking on my video. I do so hope that you like what you have to hear. If you like what you hear, then please feel free to hit like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Also, if you have any commission ideas that you want to hear from me, you can always send me a message over on my Instagram completely free. Now, let's get into the audio. And as usual, remember always, keep calm and put your headphones on. Now, let's get on to it. Hey there, dork. How you doing? Oh, come on. Don't be like that. I have a special task I know only you can do. You see, I need my paper finished for Mr. Smith's class, and I decided to go for my favorite resident nerd to do it, because your papers are always so wonderful. You don't have time, do you? Ah, uh, you talk like you think it's a request. Oh, please. I mean, you could spend your time doing something constructive, like doing my paper for me. I mean, I know you don't have friends or much of a social life. You don't belong to any of the clubs at this college. So what exactly do you have planned? You. You have a what? A date? You have a date, do you? With who? John Jones. <laughs> you had to cook up one of the most... You had to cook up one of the most generic names ever, John Jones. Then again, I don't know somebody with the name John Jones, but I'm sure that he's out there somewhere. Granted, I do know like five people with the name Jones. I swear, you sound like a grade schooler. Next thing you know, you're gonna be all like, Yeah, I have a boyfriend, he just doesn't go to school here. <laughs> All right, all right. You get away this time, only because I like it when you buy into your sick little delusions. Take care. <sighs> she has to be lying. She just has to be. There's no way I miss my shot. There's just no way. Yeah. She, she just did that to get a rise out of me. And guess what? It worked. I'm not gonna miss my chance. Ooh, I got a new request. Let's see. A cafe date tonight at 7. Alright, and this one's paid for the whole night. Hmm, this could go pretty well. Let's see. I'll take the job. Payment half and payment after. Alright, this one's a pretty high payer. Alright. Need to get out of college bully mode and into a rental BF mode. Okay, let's see. The user didn't include a picture or anything. I only have the username. Let's see. Uh, they say that they'll be wearing... Hmm, they say that they'll be wearing a white blouse, so I'm assuming it's a girl. I mean, anyway... Uh, Oh no, it can't be. She's she's wearing a white blouse. And she's like the only one here that is. And she's sitting all by herself. Don't tell me. Don't tell me that she's my rental client. Okay, play cool, play cool. Hey loser, how's it going? What, what, what? What am I doing here? Why? Um, I happen to be... I happen to need a bit of a caffeine fix, you know? No, you didn't hear anything. That wasn't my phone going off. Ugh, fine. Yeah, you got me. I'm a rental boyfriend. And as... Fate... Fate or God or whoever... Would have it, I happen to be... I happen to be yours for the night. Don't give me that look. And you better not tell anybody about it. 
hey, I make a killing because of this. I mean, I'm pretty much paying off my own school because of all because of all the money I make from losers like you. Desperate losers that are too afraid to even look a guy in the eye. Huh. All right. Well, we've already paid at least halfway for the night and the other half when I'm done. So all that's in the past right now. And and here's how this is going to go. You're not going to say a word of this around school and you are going to give me a five and you are going to give me a five star rating in return. I'll give you the same so that way you can land somebody else. How's that sound? Good. Good. I don't believe this. It feels like we're actually on a date together. Uh, if this is a dream, I want to wake up. Okay, don't blow this. Don't blow this. Say something nice. Say something nice. She she did her hair and she fixed her blouse. So say something about that. Huh. Well, don't you look decent for once? Let me guess. You had to get your big sister or even your mom to help you out, right? Stupid. You had to say it like that? She obviously worked very hard. You, uh... You date yourself, huh? You you live in an apartment, um, an apartment near campus because you're here as state, huh? Um, all right then. Well, you uh, you look good. What? I'm giving you a compliment. I can tell that you worked your damnedest, um, with your hair and your makeup, and especially that white blouse. Oh, uh, it was a gift from your grandmother? Well, I, well, I have to say, she has very good taste. So, um, since we're here, how about we start with the coffee? I mean, this is technically a cafe date, so we're mainly getting coffee, right? I mean, if you, <clears throat> if you want to get food too, that's fine with me. I'm just trying to get a feel for, for the night's events. Uh, yeah, I'll have this one with free sugars and free creams. What about you? Ah, you like it with a bit energy behind it, huh? All right. So, um, since we're here, uh, can I ask you something? How, how you feel about me? I mean, technically speaking, how you feel about me? Yeah, that's, uh, that's our sample, I guess. Um, is all right if I come clean with you on something? This was kind of my hope for a long time. I, uh, I like you. No, no, not just as a victim. I, I like you as a person, all right? It's just... You're always so passionate, and you stay true to yourself despite all the crap that people put you through. And, I don't know, I guess I just have my own crap to deal with. So, in my mind, I did all this to try and bring you down, bring you down to my level so I'd feel better about myself. But that's, that's BS, you know? And when I heard, when you told me that you have a date... It's like my mind stopped. I just didn't want to I just didn't want to accept it. But despite how you are, there are actually a lot of people that do have an interest in you. So it's like my mind couldn't register it. So if you want to tell me that you hate me or you want nothing to do with me, then I'll completely understand. Um, I'll give you your five-star rating, and you know what? You don't even have to pay me for the rest of the night. I'll, I'll even refund the down payment that you made. Um, if you have PayPal or something, or, or I can have it for you, or I can have it for cash, uh, first thing in the morning, and I can, I can give it to you Monday, if you like. You, you don't hate me, huh? You, 
you actually pretended to have a boyfriend because you wanted to make me jealous, huh? <laughs> well, I can't say it didn't work. But I do like you. You know what? How about we make this a real date? You don't... Yeah, the down payment is what got me here, but you know what? You don't have to pay for the rest of the night. Let's make this a real date. As soon as we're done with our coffee, what do you want to do? You, you just want to walk around, or we can grab a movie, we can go to the dance club, whatever you want. Alright, that sounds good for me. Alright, off we go. And I promise, no more bullying, no more harassment of any kind. Though, I would like it if you could help me out with my grades just a bit. Can you at least help me out with that part? Thank you. Thank you so much. Alright, let us continue with the real date, okay? Lead the way.